All right, boys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna continue pretty much where we left off. All right, do this. Jesus. Okay. What the fuck is that thing? Cyber demon. Don't tell me we created that thing. Corax tablets discovered during the UAC automated survey of 2143 mentioned an ancient battle in the Titan's realm during the Third Age. An expedition to the plains recovered several relics, including the petrified remains of a massive Shadow Lord believed to be an ancient Balgar demon. Researchers of the Lazarus Labs began work on piecing the creature back together. Are you insane? What is wrong with you people? You don't fuck with this shit. Um, at first, the project mandate was to construct an educational and inspirational exhibit. Yeah, right. Apparently not. Look how well that worked. Or the focus quickly shifted with an attempt to meld the petrified tissue uncovered that ex... Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, shifted when and an... Oh, they shifted when and an attempt to meld the petrified tissue uncovered that the exposure to small doses of plasmatic argent energy would reanimate the relic. Oh my god, okay. The potential of creating living, growing tissue from the relic and the lure of an ultimate battle demon was too enticing to pass up. Project team quickly shifted direction and began work on melding the ancient remains with high-tech weaponry. You guys are fucking stupid. How well did that work? How well did that work? What the fuck was that thing? Oh, hey, wrong button. Oh, jeez. Got him. Okay. Okay. Oh, Jeebus. Okay. Let's go, boys. Freaking people are stupid. Fucking with shit they don't know nothing about. Bring it! Oh, I thought that was an explosive barrel. That's my bad. I, th I thought you were an explosive barrel. Took all that for nothing. Although I am hurt, like, pretty badly. This thing is loading me up with ammo. I don't like it. Healing me up, giving me nothing but armor. Give me tons of ammo. Oh, jeez. Okay, so I'm probably gonna have to fight that big ass thing. The fuck is that thing? wrong with these people? Oh wait, I, I got I just remembered.
down. There we go. Right down your gullet. Eat that. Right down your gullet. Jeez. Okay. Disengaged. Looks like they were dissecting one of the big boys. What the fuck is wrong with these people? What the hell are these things? They look almost like parasites. You know what they look like? They look like gold. <laughs> if you guys understand that reference, you're awesome. <laughs> oh my god, look at these things. This woman was insane to keep these. Boys. Oh, let's do this. Oh, Jesus. Cornered. Oh, okay. Got him. Okay. Oh my god, these guys are getting annoying.
Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. I need to go this way. Oh, there we go. And proceed with cushion. Yeah, whatever. Let's go, boys. Access the helix. Kadun Masabetna, Cryos in Lidma, in Mat Dilak, Creon High, Olin Divinu. The fuck is he saying? What's with these tablets? Oh, jeez. Okay, let's go, boys. Let's do this, boys. Priority access only. Authorization required. Oh. oh, okay. Oh, that's a lot of armor. You should not have allowed his location to be discovered. You have failed us. It was not me. It was Samuel. He led them to his tomb. Please. We can overcome this. I promise, the gate will be opened as planned. So she did fall to their influence. Samuel saw Olivia as a protege. He sponsored her during her formal education and was driving force behind her promotion to the Global Science Council. Olivia made her fortune as one of the founders of Nanostruct Aerospace and Defense Systems, in part thanks to a sizable donation from Samuel. Livia's career blossomed, and Samuel eventually offered her the freedom to design and run her own cutting-edge laboratory by joining the UAC. Livia refused, citing that she had no interest in the energy business. When Olivia did finally leave Nanostruct, it came as a shock to the scientific community. She relinquished a position of sizable power and control to work at an isolated outpost 140 million miles from Earth. A former colleague of Olivia's at Nanostruct stated that Samuel sent her an artifact recovered near the Argent Argent Fracture, after which she became obsessed, obsessed with joining the UAC. A few weeks later, she accepted the offer and became the leader of the Lazarus Project, working directly under Samuel Hayden. Holy crap. Cyber Mancubus. Are you kidding me? So we made, we like essentially made our own. The given strain of demon has long been a subject of fascination among Lazarus Project scientists. You can understand the biology of these creatures. A team of biogenetics geneticists led by Dr. Pierce herself was forward to research and manipulate the behavior and effect of the creatures. Okay, these people were so stupid. Like what makes, what made you think you control, like you could control any of these things? You're insane. Oh man. Okay, we're slogging. Fuck. All right, I feel like this is gonna be a big, a big point. So, I'm gonna go ahead and end it right here for tonight, boys. I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell button. Peace. Bye.